One incredible thing about history is it's not quite easy to wipe out complete traces of the past. From fossils of titanic creatures like dinosaurs to ancient coins used in trade during the Bronze Age, these remnants of the distant past still lay buried beneath us and are waiting to be discovered. Luckily for us, archaeologists have been digging up such finds for decades, bringing us pieces of these ancient relics for us to marvel and wonder at. Here are 12 of the most amazing recent archaeological finds which you need to know. Be sure to smash the like button, subscribe and click the notification bell for more amazing content. Let's begin. Number 12. 12th Century Silver Penny Numismatists are going to love this one. An Englishman, Graham Rushton, was in a field in South Yorkshire with his metal detector in late 2018. As luck would have it, he found an extremely rare 12th century silver penny. The coin was in such bad condition that he didn't think much of it at the time, but after a few months later he took a picture of it and sent it to a museum to see if it's worth anything. The coin was minted during the reign of King Stephen, who took the throne of England in 1135. As of now, only 25 coins from this era are known to have survived, making Graham's discovery quite a rare one. Understandably, knowing the rarity of this coin, Graham decided to cash in and sold it at auction for a small fortune of $12,000. Needless to say, Graham is a happy man. Number 11. 2,000-year-old village Geologists will agree that landscapes and terrains can completely change over time. What was once forest can become cities or towns, and what were once cities and towns can become forests. Archaeologists proved this fact in early October 2020 when they discovered a 2,000-year-old village under a forest in the north of Poland. This settlement was found complete with farming land, boundary markers, the foundations of buildings and roads between houses, which is thought to be unique in Europe. The discovery was made in the Bory Tucholsky area, which is a woodland today and thus far had gone unexplored by archaeologists. The arrangement of the fields is consistent with the three-field system that was popular in Poland during the Middle Age. Historians now must tackle the question of whether the practice began much earlier than previously thought. Well, that's ancient history for you. Number 10. Penguin Remains In 2016, biologist Steve Emsley arrived in Antarctica in hopes of solving a mystery. He'd heard numerous tales of penguin guano on a rocky cape close to Scott Coast, but nobody has ever recorded a sighting of a penguin colony or even a live penguin there. He was onto something when he had arrived because there were pebbles dotted around the shore. This was unusual since pebbles don't often appear grouped in Antarctica, other than where the Adelie penguins live, because these birds use them to build their nests. Moving further inland, Emsley found the remains of a penguin with its feathers still attached and its flesh barely decomposed. Naturally, he assumed that he was on the verge of discovering a live penguin colony. He was wrong. What he discovered was receding ice, sealed away in permafrost and then mummified up to 5,000 years ago. It's only in recent times that the ice started to melt, revealing the remains of the penguins and their guano for the first time in living memory. There are no penguins here presently, but the current climate is suitable for modern-day penguins to survive. Number 9. 10 million year old fossilized tree Trees are timekeepers of our world. If you want to find out about the climate of the ancient world, you need to find an ancient tree. Trees have a way of recording the temperature, the chemical makeup of the atmosphere, and a lot more information about the world around them during their existence. Thanks to the discovery of a tree fossilized in Peru in September 2020, believed to be 10 million years old, we now know that a few of the things we'd always presumed about the ancient climate are incorrect. Today, this part of Peru is arid and sparse, but when the tree was alive, it was extremely humid, far more so than any climate models of the Neogene period had predicted. The average temperature appears to have been higher than it is anywhere in the world today. Evidence suggests that the tree grew at an elevation of 6,000 feet above sea level, but today its fossil is 13,000 feet up. One possible explanation is that there have been significant movements in the lithosphere between South America, but more research is required to confirm this hypothesis. Number 8. Medieval Ruins Under School Gym School might feel like a drag, but not for the students at this high school in Finland in early 2018. A school in Turku, Finland was shocked when renovation work inside their school gymnasium uncovered long-forgotten medieval ruins. Archaeologists believe that if they were to carry on digging, they would find more of the street and probably several more houses too. The school, however, isn't very keen on the idea of digging up their property. Local authorities are now trying to find a way to preserve the ancient ruins without causing any harm to the school. We hope they can find a solution which works for all parties involved. Number 7. 2200-year-old Chinese Liquor 
This ancient Chinese liquor has spent the last 2,200 years inside a sealed bronze kettle inside a Qin Dynasty tomb. The tomb is one of many that were discovered in China's Shangxi province in March 2018 and was probably occupied by a commoner rather than someone of notable social standing. This liquor was probably something that the tomb's occupant was very fond of back when they were alive. The experts who opened the kettle described the alcohol as about 300 mm milky yellow fluid. Later testing revealed that it was made of glutamic acid substances created during a rudimentary fermentation process involving honey, berries, grapes and rice. It probably tastes a little bit like rice wine. Would you try it? Number 6. Ancient Human Footprint A human footprint was discovered recently on a rock of New Mexico's Robledo Mountains and it's believed to be 290 million years old. Obviously, this is long before the emergence of human beings on the planet. According to our current understanding of history, the footprint was apparently made before dinosaurs roamed the Earth, which doesn't make sense. We can't rule out the possibility that this is a hoax or a fraud, but other footprints recorded in the area have reliably been dated back to the same time period, so we can't dismiss the idea of its veracity completely. What we might be able to say is that it was made by a human-like creature, but not a human. There are many footprints up in the mountains that seem to belong to bear-like or bird-like creatures, but not exact matches for any type of bird or bear that lives on our planet today. Could this be the footprint of a long-extinct creature that just so happened to have human-like feet? What do you think? Number 5. Mummified Baby Hand The next discovery is a little gruesome but fascinating all the same. It's the mummified hand of an infant child discovered in a graveyard in Jarlorenk, South Hungary in 2018. The rest of the child's body was skeletonized, but the hand, forearm and upper back were mummified. Biologist Janos Balos studied the strange phenomenon and came to an astonishing conclusion. A tiny copper coin in the child's hand was responsible for the partial mummification. Copper has long been known to have antimicrobial properties, but nothing on this scale has ever been seen before. Balas also discovered that the infant had been buried long after the abandonment of the graveyard. Most of the bodies here were buried between the 12th and 16th centuries, but this baby died only 150 years ago. The most likely explanation, according to Balas, is that a stillborn child was born to a commoner living nearby, who wrapped up the body of her son in cloth, buried it in the abandoned churchyard, and placed a coin in its hand to pay John the Baptist for a christening in accordance with an ancient tradition that's been observed elsewhere in Europe, but never before in Hungary. Number 4. 58 Shipwrecks in Fornoy For the next discovery, we plunge into the depths of the Aegean Sea. In 2018, experts announced that they located the undersea equivalent of the Bermuda Triangle close to Greece. Marine archaeologists have identified no fewer than 58 ancient shipwrecks near a tiny archipelago in the Aegean Sea. The wrecked ships come from several different eras from the modern age to the days of ancient Greece and its empire. This collection of lost ships that surrounds Fornoy has already been described as the most significant marine archaeological find of the 21st century. These islands are remote today, but centuries ago they were an important stopover point on major trade routes and a welcome opportunity for shore leave for the sailors on long journeys. Unfortunately for those sailors, Fornoy is infamous for its rocky reefs and treacherous sandbanks. It takes an experienced and skilled navigator to avoid getting in harm's way, and it appears that these vessels didn't have anyone with the right skill or experience on board. Another rumour is that pirates once roamed these islands, so they may have also played a role in the sinking of these ships. Number 3. Ancient Banana Farms Some versions of Australian history suggest that the Aborigines, the people who lived in Australia prior to the arrival of Western and European settlers, were primitive hunter-gatherers. A discovery made in August 2020 has proven that this wasn't the case. Experts have found the remains of ancient banana farms on an island in the country's Torres Strait, proving that organised agriculture and farming was taking place here more than 2,100 years ago. Aside from banana microfossils, experts have also found charcoal, the remains of retaining walls and stone tools. These farms and the walls that surrounded them were built to last. Historians used to believe that agricultural practices like this were conducted in ancient times in Indonesia and Papua New Guinea, but that Australia's people were less developed and that the Torres Strait almost acted like a physical divider between the two cultures. But this new discovery has changed this perception and it seems that the strait was more likely to have functioned as a bridge, allowing the understanding of farming methods to spread. History is always full of surprises. Number 2. Uratu Pithos Burial Chambers Now for some macabre finds in the world of archaeology. 
While coffin burial is the most common way to dispose of human remains in the modern world, our ancient ancestors have tried a few different methods in the past, one of them being the use of these enormous burial jars that have recently been unearthed in Van's eastern Turkey. The massive ceramic jars were buried around 2,800 years ago and are correctly known as Pithos burial chambers. The archaeologists and historians responsible for the discovery believe them to be relics of the kingdom of Urartu. The burial jars were found close to the top of an ancient fortress with the remains of a palace at its northernmost point. The next step is to get the burial jars open and find out who or what might be inside them. Number 1. 3200-year-old sword It's been over a year since a 3200-year-old sword was found on the Spanish island of Mallorca in September 2019, and archaeologists are still puzzling over who left it there and what it might mean. The sword found by accident by a civilian in a Bronze Age site is one of the very few weapons of its era ever to be discovered in Mallorca. Experts believe that it might be a relic of the mysterious Talayotic culture, the same people who are believed to have created the equally enigmatic Talayotic stone megaliths that can be found on the island. The tip of the weapon's blade has snapped off, but other than that, it's in perfect condition for an artifact so old. The placement of the sword under a stone suggests that it was left there deliberately, perhaps as an offering or as part of a ceremony we know nothing about. Only ten swords of this style have ever been discovered, and only this one is complete and mostly unspoiled. We hope you've enjoyed this series and 12 of the most amazing recent archaeological finds from around the world. Thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed the video, please let me know by clicking the like button, do share, write a comment, and don't forget to subscribe so that you can catch up my next video.